Hey guys, Faisal here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to root any variant of the LG G3 phone. Now, uh, there are a few different methods out, but the latest one uh, covers all of the US variants. Um, there were a few that were kind of left out, specifically Verizon and, and Sprint, uh, which hasn't seen any root method uh, until now. Uh, if you check out the full article that's uh, linked into the description, you'll find uh, two different methods. The one I'm gonna show you here is uh, the one for the US variants because uh, this is a Sprint variant, so uh, I don't have the ability to show you how to do the international one, but it's still a pretty easy process, and maybe not as easy as this one, and it does require a Mac or Windows computer, but um, it's basically just plugging it in and uh, hitting a key and getting rooted. Now this method is pretty easy, there's a link uh, for the app that you're going to need. It's called Stump. Uh, so go ahead and check out the link in the full tutorial and get that downloaded onto your device. You're also going to want to make sure that you have installation from unknown sources enabled. So if you go to your settings, go to security, and just make sure that this is checked right here, unknown sources. Uh, after that is done, go ahead and launch the installer for Stump. And um, it has quite a few permissions here, um, but you know they're all needed to, to do what this device does. And uh, go ahead and hit accept when you get the Google warning. And when you're done, just hit open. You're going to hear some music playing. I'm going to go ahead and turn that down. And uh, pretty simple stuff. You have the guys who created it down here. And then you have just one button, and it says press grind to continue. So go ahead and do that. And that's it. It says uh, please reboot to root. Uh, so go ahead and hold the power button and hit power off and restart. Uh, your phone will restart and then once it's back up uh, you're gonna be rooted but we're gonna need to take one more step so um, and, and that's pretty simple it just involves getting an app from the Play Store uh, installing it running it and then you are all set so uh, just hang out here for a second and we'll be right back with you Okay guys, when you are back up and rebooted, go ahead and enter the Play Store and you're going to download Super SU from Chainfire. Um, really popular app for controlling uh, what apps are able to access root on your device. So download it and then open it up. And the first thing you're going to need to do is uh, install the SU binary, so just hit continue. And um, you're going to, uh, on the next screen, hit normal and it's going to do the install. And when it's done, it's going to say installation success. It's recommended you reboot your device now. Just hit OK. And uh, that's pretty much it. Go ahead and give your device a reboot. And um, everything will be set in place. Now, once your device is rebooted, um, the, the developers do suggest that you go ahead and uninstall Stump Root. I'm going to do that now. Um, um, and after that, you are pretty much done. So... Uh, Enjoy your root, guys. Um, now, one word of warning is um, if you ever want to unroot, uh, you can do that through Super SU. Open the app, go to Settings, and then there's an option down here for full unroot. Um, now, just a word of warning it will completely unroot your device, but it will make it so that you cannot reuse Stump to get root one more time. Uh, I had to learn this the hard way, and what that required me to do was actually pull uh, uh, the factory image for the device and reload it, which is uh, a little bit of a process. It's not impossible to do, but it's not as simple as just doing a factory reset on the phone. So just bear in mind that if you do want to unroot, um, you will have to go through a few more extra steps to gain root again, at least with this method you will. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, now, now that you're rooted, go ahead and you know install uh, Exposed and get some modules on your device and start customizing. And uh, we'll have a bunch of that stuff for you too. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks, guys.